the gears are shifting, man. Yamada's just making so many more moves, and Ichika is like getting to understand, like, yeah, he does like her. Right now, we are left stranded, which is a good thing. This is a blessing in disguise. It's gonna be one on one Yamada and Ichika trying to get back home. Let's see what's gonna happen in today's episode. Bold. <laughs> like, like, just remember when she lied about the umbrella just so she could wear the jacket and get more closer and buy snacks? You think that she intentionally didn't tell the friends, dude? In the beginning, she's like, oh, I thought I told them. I thought they heard, right? So that she could plan out a 1v1 scenario? I don't know. I think I'm reaching now. <laughs> ごめん、電車なんてすぐ来るし、別に急いでるわけでも迷ったわけでも。もんじゃない。Yeah, no, she was crying last time too, remember? When she got injured in the nose and she had to reschedule and make problems for the manager and mom. Like, she's just a really, really kind-hearted sweet girl. Oh, vending machine drink Riz. Oh, ma. Milk tea Riz. She's like freaking out over the drink. The fuck? Alright, she back to she back to laughing. Yeah, come closer, dude. We're not gonna share seats? I don't know. Because, like, there was that one episode where she went into the magazine place and she was trying to be noticed by other people, but no one even knew her. Ah, uh, would people recognize? Yeah. Oh, 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 come back here. Nagasaki Hut? What is that, Pizza Hut? Dude, she's holding him back like a fucking dog. Just pulling that bag. Oh my... She, she fucking hugging that bag, dude. I thought she was like going like this. Like she fucking hugging it. Kanzaki and Hara? Yeah, they going out. I hope they go out. <laughs> Yeah, imagine oh. that. Maybe that could happen to us. You're trying to have a secret relationship? Hold up. Yamada wants to go with Ichika and then secret relationship? You wanna go? You want are you down? Don't out fumble it. Bro, come on! Oh. <laughs> Fried chicken. Oh, here's the actual boyfriend. Break up with her and go out with each color. <laughs> yeah, you fucked up. What do you mean? Like, hold the fuck up. She forgot to tell them. That each cow was in the bathroom, that's why we're late. How are you gonna act like you didn't do anything wrong? <laughs> right, big sister? Big sister? Mom? Mom's a little thick. Isekai time? Yes! <laughs> no, they did. <laughs> No, no, you are letting it go to your head, you dumbass. Every time this shit happens, you set yourself back. She sat on the back of that chair, remember? The bike? 
Oh wait, she's like waiting in front of the gate. She waiting for Isuka. <laughs> Just took his bike. She's getting way more aggressive. <laughs> Hello? Did you not get that? That was dangerous. I would have missed you if it was not for your bike. What do you mean, oh, okay? Try to think about what that means. Why would she hit would have been bad if she missed you, bro? <laughs> Just walks away. <laughs> Shoujo manga? <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no snack dates? <laughs> You just spoil the whole fucking show. Bitch, how the fuck are you gonna spoil a character death? <laughs> Thanks. Thanks. Yes, she did. Oops. She got too excited. Stop, 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 stop. Busy for you. Mom. Motherfucker. She said, oh my god, it was dangerous. I wouldn't have caught you if it was not for the bike. And then she gives you sh manga as a gift. And then you have the balls to say, weren't you waiting for someone at the front gate? Maybe it's you. The dents in my heart, bro. And I get it. Middle school kid, he's delusioned because he's trying to protect himself. He doesn't want to even think about hoping that this could be real, right? Because if it is, and because it, it, if he thinks that it is real and it's not, then it's going to hurt him. That's why he deludes himself. But oh my goodness. Signs after sign. There's like 17 different flags saying that she's into you. And he's still like, nope, can't be. Damn, she is being so aggressive though now. She's making so many moves. Okay. Solo library date. Oh! Yeah. Yeah. It's a lie, it's a lie. Oh. It's gonna fall. She gonna land on top of him. Boing. No, no, that was great. That was great. Okay. Hey, thank you. Turn your brain off. Think with your dick right now. This is one of the few times you should actually turn your brain off and just go with the instinct. あ、したは学校来る。何聞いてん。行く。図書室も行く。絶対。オッケー、オッケー、オッケー。世の中に絶対はないから。可愛いね。学校が楽しいらしい。いや、いいでよ。マン。The so apparent, right? She wants him so fucking bad. It's just like, how many more moves does she needs to make? By the time, like, like, I don't even know how they're going to start dating at this rate. Like, she needs to ask him out. And if she does, he's going to be like, nah, it must have been a bet. I bet she's just doing that because she lost the bet or something. It's like, what does she need to do? She needs to literally force a kiss on him. Like, she needs to actually pounce him. For him to realize. But even then, it might be not enough. Get in the cute girly position, bro. Come on. <laughs> Snacks are coming out. Yonda. <laughs> hey. Oh, I... Oh, I... Missed opportunity, it just dawned upon me during the manga crumb scene, right? Because, like, you know what would have been hilarious? Because, like, if this was Adachi, he would have 100% ate those crumbles of snacks. 
he would have been like, oh, it's Yamada's leftovers or something, right? <laughs> He's not that degenerate, I guess. Adachi just built there, right? 100% Adachi would have done that. We should read it together. Adachi! Oh, Adachi getting cocked! Yo! Well, I wonder. I wonder if Adachi is like, damn, Ichikawa actually doing it? He's pulling Yamada right now? Adachi can't believe what's going on. No, I don't think Adachi feels cucked. Of course, Adachi was always down for Yamada, but he's just down bad for anybody. I think he is genuinely, like, impressed and shocked right now. It's like, are you serious? Ichigaki of all people? Oh, very close. Yeah, she does. She does have a crush. Oh, come on, of course you care. No, we're not gonna be your wingman. It's Nah, get your own girl, bro. Get out of here. The other- Yamada's friends, the other girls, he was like, you know, hanging out with them pretty well, though. え、いや。いないということは知ってるが。ま、いいや。お、お、お。しかし無謀だな。山田なんて。好きなんだから、しょうがなくね。うん。そうだな。やべ、はず。気づいたのは最近だな。うん。どういう時に大人。Motherfucker! I thought you were going somewhere nice with this! Come on, dude! Like, ah, every line he dishes out! Come on, bro! What Adachi is saying, I don't think is totally off. It's basically this, right? When you are degenerate enough to rub one off to a girl that you know, that's lust, okay? That's not love. You don't see her as a romantic intent. You see her as an object of desire and lust. But there comes a point when you see a girl beyond that and can see her as an actual person that you can respect and love. And at that point, Arachi can no longer do that. <laughs> Doesn't that mean I don't really like her? Then? No, if, if he's not, you're not as degenerate as Arachi. You're a sweet boy, bro. Nothing. He just sees the tits, bro. You don't know anything about her, man. No one cares, bro. Yeah, I feel dirty by this. Even I feel like having that conversation about Yamada with Yadachi, it just felt so disrespectful, man. I feel like, ugh, something got sullied there. Or, Innocent, pure girl just got just, just, ugh, just stained, man. Now, what's gonna happen? Like, ugh, I hope their romance develops to the point where Ichikawa can, like, flex on Adachi and be like, yeah, I'm going out with her. But, like, is a confession gonna happen this early in the game? I t I'm not sure. Maybe it will, maybe it won't. And then Yamada also did mention the potential of, like, keeping a secret relationship. That's a pretty interesting twist, huh? Having a secret dating relationship? <laughs> Because you actually care about her. Huh? Yes. Oh, <laughs> She's sitting on his desk? Yeah. Wow, amazing. Nothing. It means nothing. Fuck off, Adachi! 
僕だってエロい目で見てやっぱり山田を好きじゃないのかなあなあなあなあどうしよう教えてよイスペルスナックスああ No eating in the library Our dates it's a ruin No Well 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 It's simple We just go over to Yamada's place or we invite her over to our place and we can eat all the snacks we want we can read the manga together no 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 a pinch is always a chance turn a disadvantageous situation into a trump card this may be a leeway into inviting us over or we just lie and just yeah we just don't get caught maybe who's gonna be fucking monitoring this shit man oh お菓子食べられない。昨日までこんな張り紙なかったよね。そう言われればそうだな。ことだ。そこがおかしいんだよ。当たり前の。あれもいい食なんて。You was that a Yamada joke? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Yamada joke. Yo, yo, she cooking now. Well, we got caught. Well, we didn't get caught, but the teacher kind of got mad. Right? Try to like... And then we tried to bluff, right? And, and Ichikawa did manage to like swerve around it, but... Eh. At the same time you were here though? I can't fucking keep what, what, who knows? What what was it a joke before then? So the one before was a joke, but this time she's actually like I can't fucking tell. The joke is that I can't fucking tell if it's a joke. いやいやいや。今度は<笑> She guilty. What can she say? <laughs> it's her candy wrap. What was that camera angle? Never seen her so shocked in my life before, bro. No more snacking. Well, that's the thing, right? She used to come here just to sneak in the snacks and eat alone so she doesn't have to share. But now, remember what I said before? What did I say last episode? What happens when the obsession with candy switches to obsession over each color, right? So if she shows up to the library now, even if there's no candy allowed, then like, you know, that's, that's like true signs that she really loves him. Also, he's, what is he fucking doing? What is he reading here? I think he's reading the different manga instead of a book. I don't know, he's got two books right now. <laughs> Murder encyclopedia. Nah, bro. She doesn't give a fuck. She doesn't give a fuck. You're like, nah, I'll break a rule. You think I give a fuck about that sign? I'm still going to eat. Who going to who going rat on me? Huh? You? Based? Who can stop her? But she won't. Oh! She's in Ichikawa's spot. Yo, she's where we used to be! Oh no! Put that shit away! Reaction speed! Make it stop! Yo, it's getting so bad. Why the fuck is it getting so epic right now? There's still so much of the episode left and they already showed this, you know? How they showed this sign? It says Carte 6, like Carte, like fucking chapter, whatever, right? This is getting so dramatic. Oh! 
Oh, he making a move. Yo, he's kind of looking like a giga set right now, though. I melted it. I don't know how she wouldn't have heard Yamada literally say, Huh, I always knew there was a risk. Who gonna stop me? I'm gonna eat anyways. But she thought that, you know, Oh, high school romance. Sorry, middle school romance. That's cute. I melted it. Melted what? Did he melt his heart? Did he melt the chocolate in Yamada's palm as he squeezed it? I don't know. <laughs> That was a nice move, man. You saved her. What does Yamada think of that, though? Because, like, what does she think just happened? Does she think that Ishikawa just, like, saved her from the candy? I think Yamada's too focused right now. I don't think Yamada even is aware that the teacher was there, bro. She's just too, like, shocked that he, like, reached out and held her hand. What is she thinking? It melted, the chocolate. Yeah. Now let me wash that hand for you. If it was Adachi, she'd be licking that hand. Go away. Because <laughs> she wants to fucking eat. Go away. I want to I wanna lick that chocolate off my hand. It's going to be a waste. And it's embarrassing if you watch this shit. Okay. <laughs> She's so childish, man. So cute. What did she think outside of that, right? Is there anything else? What did you think about the hand grab? That's like saying a girl's fat. Hey, 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 wording, wording, wording. Nah, she's gonna show up again. This is just the beginning. She's back. And no snacks. But she back. Why do you think he's, she's here? <laughs> she's still gonna, of course, fucking eat regardless. Okay. It's the, because the candy is here, he's still gonna fucking second guess himself. But, you know, I hope he realizes. Huh? <laughs> Okay, post credit scene, let's go. She gives it to you. She gives a wrapper and says, throw it out. You kept that bag? That's some Adachi behavior. Yeah. Because you. Because you ate off of it. He, pro bro, he probably fucking puts the, the potato bag in his head. And he probably goes like... <gasps> and he takes it off every night or some shit. But that is today's episode of Dangers in My Heart. And more advancements. More advancements. Now, Yamada, like, hugging Ichikawa's bag and saying, like, huh, don't you think, you know, a couple going out from the same school is kind of, like, cool? What about a secret relationship? Does that mean that we're getting hinted at potentially a secret relationship between the two? I would like it if they would kind of flex to the public and each everyone would know that Ichikawa is dating Yamada, but that's an interesting uh, potential. The rest of it was basically just more of Yamada just, like, actively approaching Ichikawa. She waited outside of the school gates. Noticed him by the bike, gave him the manga. But dude is so delusional because he doesn't want his heart broken. He thinks that, nah, nah, she's not doing this for me. And then the library notice, you know, saying no more snacks. Yes, she's sneaking in. But it led to one of the coolest moments and dangers in my heart. This scene right here, this panel from Ichika, actually looking like a main character, man. He's genuinely looking like a main character now. Before, you know, th th he has his moments. I think this is his best moment so far, right? What were we trying to do? Just make sure that the teacher didn't see Yamada with snacks in her hand. So we grabbed her hand and it melted the chocolates. At the end of the day, it's not a big deal. But it is a big deal that he would reach out to do that. He even said in his head, like, I really must like her. And then, Yamada? I couldn't tell what she was thinking, right? 
with this look from Yamada, was it like, oh, don't you dare try to steal my snack? Or was she like, oh my god, he saved me. The way that she said, go away, as she licked her hand, classic Yamada. But hey, she's still back here. Even if she's, you know, stealing snacks and she's still back here. And the relationship, it's slowly starting to form. It's just, Yamada is hard caring. She's doing, like, 95% of the work, she's doing everything. I just hope that Ichika will actually make a move in a couple episodes in the future. And that's it for me. If you're still here, though... If you didn't enjoy the reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlists for more content, and until next time, take care.